Instruments can be inserted from the thousands of symbols provided in Vectorworks symbol libraries or created as custom symbols that you convert into lighting instruments. Use the Lighting Instrument tool to insert an existing instrument symbol. The Lighting Instrument tool can be found in the Lighting tool set. When the Lighting Instrument tool is selected, select the lighting symbol you wish to use from the resource selector. The resource selector will be found in the top left in the toolbar. The resource selector is very similar to the resource manager, but it will only display resources that can be used with the currently selected tool. So in this case, we are only seeing lighting symbols. In the left-hand column, we can scroll down and find the specific lighting manufacturer we are looking for. I normally recommend just running a search in the top right here, as it saves time from having to scroll through the list on the left and then all the symbols in the selected file. Double-click or highlight and then choose Select to select the lighting symbol we want to use. We can now place the lighting device where we want it in the drawing. In the Object Info Palette, we will find a number of different options and settings for the lighting devices. The lighting device symbol information will automatically fill in some fields, such as field and beam angle. All settings can be configured by clicking the Edit button in the Object Info Palette. This will open the Lighting Device dialog box, where the different settings are divided into different tabs, such as Instrument Properties, Light Information, and Shutters. We will cover these different settings in more detail in another video. If we already have hanging positions in the drawing, we can place the lighting device on top of the hanging position. I would recommend placing the lighting devices on their own layer that is stacked above the layer that contains the hanging positions. This will automatically make it so that the lighting devices are stacked above the hanging positions in a top plan view. In the Object Info Palette, we should see that the position field is automatically filled in if we place the lighting device over top of a hanging position. If the lighting device is attached to the hanging position, it will automatically move with the hanging position both in XY changes as well as Z changes.